And this award goes to the one and only Haley Bailey for the best mother award. Woo! Party world. And yo, we talking about that man DDG and Holly today, fam. And I ain't gonna lie, the disrespect to them got to stop. So recently, DDG and Holly were going through it, and they had a whole social media Twitter thing online. It was amazing, bro, where this weirdo spoke ill of DDG's partner, Holly. I don't even want to say partner because she's a very accomplished and talented woman in her own right. You already know. But he basically said, we smoking on your great granny, bro. Like, <laughs> his mom has some, like, neurodivergence. Some, some sad story about his mom being sick. But the dude said something racist. So, DDG packed him up. Put him in a certified pack. So, DDG took a W off that, bro. And many people started to see and kind of appreciate the way he defended and appreciated his partner. And, you know, his woman. And I think that that's something that we need to really come back at lately, bro. Which is start appreciating positive representations of black couples in media i feel like we've been seeing a lot how they love to the ricky bobby it you know as if there's a lot of these couples that are just terrible that are just bad narratives but there's so many affluent african couples you know that are positive representations of love and affection that i feel like the media doesn't always like to show and i feel like the way he treats her and values her Especially with the way the media, especially, I say media, I mean Twitter, heavy on Twitter. The way they talk, this man is a bum. The way they talk, this man, DDG's done nothing with his life. He's just some bum with no money who's just light-skinned, who just happened to be the most successful black woman ever. Respect to Holly. She's done her thing. She's talented. She's all of the above. That's stamped. But stop playing like this man, DDG, is not a literal top five YouTuber black stamped, bro. Like, his impact on YouTube content creation it as a whole is insanity bro what he did in the amount of channels he's made successful generating two three hundred four hundred a month like that dude is making millions dog off the passive bro he deleted the channel worth millions and stills making passive m's bro like people don't understand the impact this man ddg's done bro he's choosing to be a rapper he's living his life now he's done it bro he's certified any amount of money that holly can make unless she keeps doing movies will be not pennies but it won't mean much to someone who's already defined like that let's not make money a focus they love and care about each other fam and i feel like that's what i'm trying to argue or you know speak on look at them together not separate because this man ddg has been an amazing w partner dog i saw a video that recently came out where holly was uh, about to be awarded or nominated for three awards and sadly she did not win any of them but this man ddg bought like fake award replicas set up a whole video for her did like a whole sounds and everything and just gave her like gave her an award for best mother most beautiful most talented most like amazing like bro just showered his girl just showering his girlfriend with some love and some affection you know a point where it's clear you know she could always need it show love to the young mom show love to the young woman out here that you know need to pick her up sometimes and i feel like he showed that as a w partner fam it's just sad because when we look at a lot of these issues with ddg he's always came off corny and things like that because he's a big youtuber that doesn't play the youtube game and to say that basically says that he plays, you know, into the clout sometimes. He plays into, you know, the storylines, you know, you know, kind of playing along with sometimes the YouTube lackadaisical way of, you know, content grabbing and attention. But he'll just cut it out sometimes and just be like, I don't rock with somebody. You're a weirdo. I'm not feeling you. This is actually a big thing with So Illuminati, where for years and years, So Illuminati was taking some pretty big dubs on ddg i'm not gonna lie bro he even had people a few months ago talking about the ddg doo-doo garbage thing and ddg being a smart man he is bro he made all his stuff on spotify also line up with the doo-doo garbage this man ddg is a funny smart marketer bro and i really do appreciate and respect people like him dog because these are the people that i'd rather kids look up to than a lot of these other artists that are promoting and scamming and you know harming the people that they care about and you know not being a good look or representation i'd rather they look up to people like that you could say he's corny you could say all that other stuff 
those are all valid in their own ways but the points i made are a fact i'd rather kids look up to somebody that's showing and appreciating the woman that they care about than you know degrading you know doing them dirty now look I think this was a really cool video overall too bro because when i see a lot of examples online about you know black love you know black family and all that stuff bro it'd be a lot of corny stuff bro like a lot of them old memes or stuff where it's like you know just od or it'd be the whole opposite where it just be straight cheating memes over and over i'm like bro we over that stuff bro I, I don't know who they it's the dude who does the skits bro i don't like him he does the skits bro where at the end he always comes back after cheating bro i'm like dog this is corny bro it's corny i'm gonna find one bro because dog that dude is so corny <laughs> like bro he needs to just take one from ben the don but ben the don a goat drewski a goat but that dude he is not their caliber bro i am a hater on that dude a certified hater on that dude bro Cause I don't like the narrative they pushing out. It's corny, bro. But I respect DDG Heavy for the way he values and loves his partner and loves and values Highly Bailey fam. Highly's a goat. I sometimes feel sad, you know, that I we didn't get to see her acting career or her music career flourish as much, you know, as it can. Of course, it still can. Beyonce's done it. Rihanna's done it. Goats have done it. It's happened. Lauren Hill. Ah, kinda she did it as well go there for what she did beforehand but you know her label and all that other stuff oh i gotta do a breakdown on hill too i'm rambling though y'all boys basically to get back to the point because you know <laughs> i could talk about lauren hill for days she is one of them ddg and holly are a real w couple and i really like to see what they represent in the culture and what they represent online i saw a recent trend on twitter where it was showing you know dads throwing their babies up in cool ways and showing you know active participation in you know being in your kid's life and i feel like that narrative that we not there is so crazy bro because we actually be there a lot more than people think and i feel like that's a cool way you know to bring more awareness i like what ddg doing i like the way he treats his partner i like that whole interaction that they do and i think ddg is gonna keep being a legend and how he's moving i hope he keeps dropping music consistently and takes this rapid stuff serious because to me throwing away a lot of free money on youtube is crazy to me but money isn't everything happiness internal things and being with your partner is so important as well so cloudy world and honestly let me know what y'all think about this whole thing how do you feel about holly and ddg overall and their relationship do you feel like holly sold or whatever y'all think do you feel like ddg sold or whatever y'all think i think they a w i really respect what they doing and i like it it's cool Cloudy world, let me know what y'all feeling, <laughs> and we gone.